Thank you. First, let me assure you, I have two gorgeous children. <laughs> One of whom is a physician and internist. Her husband is also. They are both at the Leahy Clinic in Boston. I think about her a great deal as I listen to so many of you this evening and learn so much from what you've said. Research America is clearly spreading its wings wide, hoping for the kinds of insights and understandings of so many, many problems we face. I happen to be the person behind the microphone, and therefore, tonight, you honor me with this award. But you have to know that there are five absolutely wonderful full-time and two wonderful part-time producers that make it all possible who prepare me by doing the work that they do so that I can come before you each and every day with the kind of information that I think our whole country needs. I would, at this moment, having such a prestigious audience here before me, beg and plead with you to do more to understand both Parkinson's and Alzheimer's, two diseases that will in some way strike each and every one of us. Several months ago, I had to transfer my own husband into assisted living he suffers from Parkinson's with Lewy body dementia. It is a terrible, terrible disease to watch a man who was so strong, so healthy, so brilliant to experience this and to have watched so many of our friends go through the hideous downward ladder of both Parkinson's and Alzheimer's. How can we, as people in this country, put so much money into so many deserving areas without focusing on those two diseases which someday will strike each and every single one of us in some way. I beg you, I plead with you to do everything you can. I do so humbly at the same time, thanking you for all you do and for honoring me tonight. Thank you.